the first step is to open new tab, Google Chrome. Click Login Login. Click in the email bar and enter your email. OR you can locate your email from the options. Then you may click Next. Type in your password. If you do not know your WebAssign credentials, please contact a Cengage representative and do not continue this tutorial until you can successfully log in to WebAssign. Click Sign In. Scroll down in the WebAssign.net page and locate the Web Assign course you wish to link to your Canvas course. Once you identify the course you wish to link, note the name of the course including the section number. Then open a new tab to log in to ACES. Type in www.alamo.edu in the address bar and press Enter. Click on Log in to ACES. Type in your ACES username. Type in your ACES password. Click on the Canvas icon. Scroll down your list of courses in your dashboard or go to All Courses to locate the Canvas course which you wish to link to the WebAssign course identified in Step 8. Click on the course name. Scroll down the left navigation bar. Click on Settings. Click on the Navigation tab. Scroll down until you see the Cengage tool under the Disabled Pages, Tools. With your mouse, click and drag Cengage tool, then drop it up into the Enabled Pages, Tools category. With your mouse, click and drag the Cengage tool under the Home Page tool for maximum visibility. Then scroll down and click on Save. Then you will need to click on the Cengage tool you just added to the navigation bar. Click Cengage. If this is the first time clicking on the Cengage tool, you may be prompted to log in to your Cengage account, use same credentials as WebAssign. Contact a Cengage rep, if needed. Then click Add Homework Platform. Click in the search bar. Type Larson in search bar and press Enter. Locate textbook used for the course you are trying to link, integrate. See course syllabus, if needed. Click link to course. Click link to an existing course. Click on the WebAssign course title you identified in Step 8. Click on the identified WebAssign course title. Click Continue. There are three options to proceed. I will review all three before moving on. Option 1. Click Publish. This link will take students to the WebAssign course. Students may work on assignments within WebAssign and no assignment links and no assignment grades will be imported into Canvas. Option 2. Do not publish this link. Instead, add individual assignment links, shown next. Students use assignment links in Canvas to work on WebAssign and no WebAssign assignments and no grades will be imported into Canvas. Option 3. Do not publish this link. Instead, add individual assignments, shown next. Students use assignment links in Canvas to work on WebAssign and all WebAssign grades will be imported into Canvas and automatically update as students progress. For option 1, students access WebAssign assignments using the general WebAssign course link. 
WebAssign grades, averages will need to be entered manually in Canvas. The easiest way to do this is to add a Canvas assignment for WebAssign averages. For option 2, students access WebAssign assignments using the individual WebAssign assignment links. WebAssign grades, averages will need to be entered manually in Canvas by adding a Canvas assignment for WebAssign averages. To add a WebAssign average Canvas assignment, click Assignments. Otherwise, for option 3, skip to step 47. Click Add Assignment button. Title the assignment. Click on title bar. Type in description. Type in the number of points, usually 100 for 100% 100 completion. Click on the assignment group drop-down. Select the appropriate assignment group, or create one, then select it. Click WebAssign Assignments. Click on the Submission Type drop-down. Click on No Submission. Click Save and Publish. Recall, only create this WebAssign Assignment Average Canvas Assignment if you are choosing Options 1 or 2. Do not create this Canvas Assignment if you choose Option 3, Individual Canvas Assignments will automatically be created. Click Home. Option 2 will import individual WebAssign links into Canvas. Option 3 will import individual Canvas assignments for each WebAssign assignment. In the case of Options 2 and 3, do not publish the WebAssign course link shown here. Now we continue. For all three options, click on the Cengage tool. For all three options, click on Select Content. For all three options, you will need to select Cengage Technical Support, Cengage Unlimited Student Dashboard, and WA EBK Calculus Early Transcendental Functions. For all three options, the companion site is optional. Option 1. Do not click on any assignment boxes. For options 2 and 3, proceed by clicking on all assignments. You must do this individually for each assignment you wish to import. Click Highlight. 4. Usually the assignment names are listed. However, I may be using an old Calc 3 WebAssign course and therefore the assignment titles are not showing. Regardless if the titles show or not, click on each assignment you'd like to link, add. However, if using option 3, you must click on every assignment and be sure the boxes are checked on the right for adding the assignments to the gradebook. For option 2 uncheck these boxes to the right to create individual assignment links but no grades from WebAssign will be imported into Canvas. So you'll still need the Canvas assignment titled WebAssign Average created in Step 37. Once everything you would like to select has been checked, you may then click Continue. You will see this as everything uploads. Then it will take you back to Modules, Homepage. Notice since the assignments imported had no titles, they all have the same name in Canvas. These can be easily changed, if necessary. 1414 and 2412 courses should not have this issue. All assignments, links will have titles before and after importing. For option 3, all these Canvas assignments are now linked to the WebAssign assignments. This means the grades will populate the Canvas grade book and update as students work on these assignments in WebAssign. If using option 3, you may view the WebAssign grades via Canvas Grades. Click Grades. For options 1 and 2, no WebAssign grades will be imported into Canvas. 
you can view WebAssign grades in WebAssign and manually calculate a WebAssign average then enter the grades in Canvas manually under the assignment created in Step 37. Once you've imported everything you need, you must disable the Cengage tool. Scroll down left navigation bar and locate the Settings link. Click on Settings. Click Navigation. With your mouse, click and drag the Cengage tool, then drop it below. You will need to drag it down into the Disables Pages, Tools category to fully disable the Cengage tool. Once the Cengage tool is disabled, you're all done with WebAssign and Cengage integration, linking. Scroll down and click Save.